Hello and welcome to part 12 in this series of tutorials for Excel beginners. In this tutorial we're going to look at printing. It's fairly straightforward printing but there's one or two things you need to look at uh, in order to make sure that the thing that comes out is what you wanted. What I'll do first of all is show you what we had at the end of the last tutorial. I just created this pie chart and I haven't really positioned it on the chart on the spreadsheet where I wanted it. I've just left it for now. And if I go straight to print preview you'll see what we get. Now print preview is just that little white sheet button there with the magnifying glass on it even pops up a tooltip when you point to it. You're probably familiar with that button. So if I click on it now you'll see what we're going to get. Um, I can zoom in on that if I want to just put the little magnifier over the page and click. And obviously it looks a bit rubbish at the moment because I haven't positioned the chart properly um, and there's one or two things also I need to correct on the, on the data table which we'll look at in a second. So the first thing I'll do is close the print preview because that's not what I want. I'm just going to zoom out on the spreadsheet so click on the drop down zoom box there and I'm going to zoom out to 50%. Now that magnification I can't really see clearly what's on the spreadsheet but I'm not concerned about that. What I'm concerned about is just getting things positioned so it's okay for printing at the moment. First thing I'm going to do is move the chart and to do that simply click on the chart to select it and then I can click and drag and position it and in this case I'm going to position it just below the the sheet of data or the data table if you like and you'll see there it's uh, looking a bit better. Now if I go back to print preview I just want to show you by the way I've got the chart highlighted and if I go back to print preview now you'll see something interesting if I just click on that and zoom out it's only printing the chart. Now the reason for that is I've selected the chart um, it's worth knowing that if you just want to print one of your charts, you can simply select it, go to print, and it will just print the chart and nothing else. However, I don't want that here. I want to put on the data itself, so I'm going to close the print preview again, and I'll zoom in a little bit. First of all, I need to click away from the chart, and I'll zoom back into 75%. Now, what I'm going to do here is resize the chart so that it fits within the left and right margins of the data table. In other words, I need to shrink this chart down so it comes into line with this right margin here. All I need to do is just scroll down on my spreadsheet a bit so you can see the full chart. Again, select the chart and resize it. You can use either of these... Um, corner drag handles. I'll use the one on the top right here and I'm just going to drag in so it fits neatly under the data table. Now one thing I'll notice straight away is that the chart again reformats itself. It always does this. 